treasure! Oh my Hobby Science Lab! We're going to take a challenge and see if it floats or sinks. So first, for our science project, we're going to fill up our pan with water. And Hobby Pig, you add the rest. Then hand each hobby kid a piece of foil. And you're gonna crumple it up into a ball. Real tight, small ball as you can. Super tiny. Will it sink or will it float? Let's find out. Ooh, oh. what happens? It floats. It floats. What, how does it float? Now you're gonna make each piece of foil into the shape of a boat. And we're gonna add things to our boat to see if we can get our boat to float. I'm near my boat. Go ahead and put it in the water. Good job. They still float, pretty cool, huh? Yes. Now we need to put people inside of our boat. So grab your little marbles, that'll be your people. And now let's see if we can get the marbles to float inside of our boats. Do marbles float? Let's find out. Ooh. Oh. oh, Hobby Bear's capsized, it went sideways. His people oh, fell oh. out. Oh. oh, your boat sank. Hey, mine lasted the longest. So how many people were able to fit with your poor sink? Uh, let's put these in water. <laughs> How about the audience at home watches it again and leaves their comments. How many marbles were in Hobby Pig's boat before it started to sink? Now at the same time, you're gonna throw one marble and your foil ball in and see which one floats and which one doesn't. Ready, set, go. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> so which one's floated, which one sink? The marbles. The marbles sink. Now, do you guys wanna know why? Why, it's heavier? If it floats, it must have many tiny air pockets in between the items. There is actually air inside the crevices of this piece of foil and that's what makes it float. There's any air that can get in. Now I've got some cool stuff that we can do to see if it floats or sinks. Let's see if these little baby Shopkins will float. Which one do you want? I want this one. Okay, he wants the pink one. Which one do you want? Hmm. The green shampoo. Okay, on your mark. Will it sink, will it float? Get set, go. Mm. Oh, they totally sink. Probably because these things are solid plastic. There's no air. No air is inside. That's why they sink. Now we're gonna see if Cheerios floats. Will it float? Mine are stuck together, see that? They're conjoined twins. <laughs> I think that mine float. I think that they float because I've seen them float before. Let's try it, ready, set, go. Oh, they it. float. So you know why they float? Why are they floating? Yeah, they're shaped like a circle, and circles have an air pocket. That's one big air pocket. No. Yeah, well, it was. It has, the Cheerio has little teeny tiny pockets of air inside of it. So as soon as it fills up with water, then it'll start to sink after a long time. That was my second guess, Ashley. <laughs> but I'm serious, it was like, it's real tiny. That's right. Good job. See, we're learning science. Oh no! King Bob has taken over SpongeBob's boat. Will it sink or float? It totally sank. King Bob stole SpongeBob's treasure. <gasps> Bad King Bob. King Bob trapped the SpongeBob crew. We need to get them out so they, so they could open up their treasure. Where are they trapped? Inside the boat! Inside right here. I don't know how we could save them. They're inside right here. Whoa! Uh, oh no! We gotta put 
these little surprise eggs together so they can do mutiny to King Bob. Mr. Crab says, Arby treasure. My washer. You need to go back to being good. And that's pretty funny. Oh yeah, it's like he could be my friend. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Just another day in paradise. <laughs> Arr, are we gonna get the treasure or what? Not if I have anything to do with it. <laughs> I have the treasure. I have the treasure! Oh my goodness, they're gonna drop pennies! Chocolate gold coin for the hobby kids! I'm gonna ah. spend them wise. Here's all this for one coconut drink. <laughs> Oh, there's Hobby Frog. He shows up with the candies around. Oh, yeah. I know how you tick. He's opening up his chocolate coin. Oh, he ate it whole. How is it? Oh, he gives it a thumbs up. How about Hobby Bear? How is it? Oh, he gives a thumbs up also. Will this life ref Hold SpongeBob. Looks like it's floating. So far, so good. Oh, it's holding him up. Let's see if we can get his friend Patrick on there too. Come on. I want oh no. I want what? Um, Let's do Sandy. It's getting heavier. Oh, 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 still floating. I think it could hold this. Oh. oh. Was that funny? It's holding. The Did whole the audience. <laughs> I don't know. Will they sink? Will you guys sink or float? We put you in there. Plankton has to walk the plank. This is terrible. I don't know if I'm going to sink or swim. Ah. Body would think, but I think I'm it. floating! It's because there's air inside my head. Wait. Wait. I'm I'm smart, I promise. What? Crocodile. I got what it's in. Will it sink or swim? I think it will swim. Hey! Oh. It floats. Why does it float? His air got trapped underneath his belly. See those? Ah! Ew, Sandy has a fly on her helmet. <laughs> Give a thumbs up if you guys can see that real fly. That's a real life fly. It's pooping. Oh, it's so gross. Is it pooping? Shoe fly. Oh, it's like a lazy <laughs> fly. Ah! family videos. You'll have fun. Go ahead. Choose any one you see here. Keep the hobby fun going. We have so many videos to choose from. We have adventures. We do science. We have arts and crafts. Go ahead. Just click one.